here we have some basic graphs of the kinds of functions that are going to come up over and over again. And you should get familiar with these so that you can see them and at a glance know what kind of a function they are. In this very first one, we have a straight line. And this is a function where the, the function f of x equals some constant number. So f of x equals 1 is just a line at uh, y is equals 1. Uh, this diagonal line, this is a, a function where f of x equals x. So y equals x, this is the shape you get. When you have this v, you're usually dealing with an absolute value function. So this is the function, uh, the absolute value of x. And then this guy right here is the square root of x. So it starts at 0 and has this sort of uh, slope off to the right. You probably recognize this one. This is a parabola. This is what you get with a quadratic. So this is y equals or f of x equals x squared. Here, this kind of funny s-like shape, this is the cubic function or f of x equals x cubed. And then we have two rational functions to get familiar with. This with these two um, sort of arms that have asymptotes that uh, approach the axes on you know, either side here of the origin. Um, this is the function 1 over x. And then if you square that, 1 over x squared, you get them both in the upper quadrant because you wouldn't get any negative values there. Um, and same kind of arms that reach up uh, towards the, the axes as asymptotes. So those are the functions to get familiar with. Our job in this problem is to match them, uh, to figure out which ones do we have here. So in this first one, we've got uh, these two arms. They look like they're approaching the axes as asymptotes, and they're both positive. So this is f of x equals 1 over x squared, one of those rational functions. All right, and here we have a straight line. So this is f of x equals a constant. And in this case, it's at 1. So we'd say f of x equals 1. Here we have our basic parabola. So this is the quadratic, or f of x equals x squared. And this one is our square root function, starting at 0, sloping off to the right. So this is, oops, lost my pen. This is f of x equals the square root of x. So that is a little bit of work with matching parent graphs or mother graphs to their equations.